some good news. A 53-year-old man who had been reported missing for 48 hours has been found. And this was minutes after a Citizen TV report. Thomas Kamuyu was sighted in Karen, roaming near the Bomas of Kenya. The puzzling mystery, however, is how does a patient disappear from Kenya's largest referral hospital, that's the Kenya Kenyatta National Hospital, without being noticed? Well, Kamuyu went missing at the accident and emergency unit as he awaited admission. <laughs> The family of 53-year-old Thomas Kamuyu Ndungu can now breathe a sigh of relief. He has been found and will be reunited with his relatives. Earlier in the day in Dagoreti, Nairobi, his wife and children agonized over his disappearance, questioning how he could have gone missing from the Kenyatta National Hospital. On Monday, 20th July, they took him to the hospital's accident and emergency unit. He was taken to the hospital for a CT scan to assess some head injury. However, he was also reported to be suffering from depression and memory loss. To Lupom letter, uh, through, through the day, I was a test and I was going to get a job. I was going to get a CT scan. But the doctor was CT scan was not available. So the doctors work advice to admit you and the doctor ya kikuja asubui afanyiwe CT scan. Tulienda kuongojea risiti ndo ya kwanza ikatoka 5:30 hapo ya pili ikatoka 9:30 hapo. Venye nilipelekea daktari akaniambia juu hata ndo nilikuwa nimeongojea nipeleke mgonjwa wako ward. Wacha ni twende ni kuonesha mali utamweka alafu nyinyi uko sawa unaenda nyumbani. Nika, nika kietisha babangu hapo, nika ambia sekiriko, hamuangalie juu wako na losi ya memory kidogo, asiamuke juu na ezaamuka peke yake ya ende nyumbani, ama atoke inje ya ende maadi pengine. To beat the curfew, they left him in the hospital's care, knowing that he would be transferred to the ward. They made all the necessary payments, confident that he had been admitted, but a distress call from the hospital would subject them to a frantic search for their father. Ndo walikuwa wananipigia simu, Kuniambia ati nikuje ni tafute baba yangu hospitali ya wamuoni ni mpeleke hapo kwa casualty. Tuka waomba wa review CCTV waone kama wataona akitoka. Wakatuambia CCTV enye washa review ni akiingia lakini awajafikia CCTV kama alitoka. A statement released to newsrooms from KNH acknowledged that indeed the incident occurred at the main facility. The matter was reported to the police that KNH also conducted its own investigations. The statement read in part, and I quote, Our priority now is to find the patient and connect him with his family and to provide appropriate health care. But for his family, more questions linger. Who was responsible? At what point was there a lapse so much that he could go missing? Kamui's wife and children had vowed to stake out at the hospital until he is found. But his sighting after Citizen TV News report, as far as Karen from the Kenyatta National Hospital, ended the frantic search. Dorcas Wangira, Citizen TV, Nairobi.